welcome to the Russo channel once again. I'm your host, Russo. Not Russo Plays. We're not, we don't play here. This is serious. <laughs> um, today, I wanted to do a video where I basically show you guys a bunch of secrets. I'm going to show you some Tapping God secrets. I'm, gonna, I'm even going to show you guys some secrets about anime battle tycoon almost forgot the name i am a little bit rusty because as you guys know if you've been watching my main channel videos i've been kind of ill been kind of sick actually i'm not really sick okay i i've been i puked for like a whole night and then my throat really hurts and stuff so that's basically what i'm going through i don't have COVID or anything and all that but anyways i wanted to show you guys some sneak peeks into our assets place basically just go over the assets place some pets that we've had in the in the past, some pets that we're gonna have in the future, some things that maybe we didn't use yet, and maybe even show you some stuff on Anime Battle Tycoon. Just give you guys a little bit of a behind the scenes sneak peek. Cause I said I would do stuff like that. You know, this is like extra content, sneak peek content, behind the scenes kind of stuff. So if you guys wanna see more of this stuff, let me know. And of course, like the video if you enjoyed, even though it's not over yet. Wait, maybe I should say that at the end. And also subscribe if you want to see more stuff on this channel. I think we could hit 200K pretty soon, so let's let's do that. Um, the support on this channel already has been insane. Um, so thank you for <laughs> thank you for hanging out and watching both channels. You guys are actually the goats. You're you're not actually goats. You're humans probably. Unless there's a goat watching this, might be a goat watching this. Um, let's start by looking at some of our previous assets. As you guys can see, we have an organized assets place with all of the pets and eggs that we've ever had implemented to the game right here. Now, this is nothing groundbreaking, but it's just cool to see in assets all organized together because these are all in the game as actual eggs and stuff. And this just shows you, this is something that's actually been unused. We wanted to use this as a way of collecting diamonds. Um, it was gonna be like a big diamond collection. So like all those little diamonds that you see that you collect everywhere, we were, we were gonna have piles of them and then we were gonna have safes of them that was going to give you basically a huge boost of them. Um, but the reason we haven't added it is because diamonds are pretty OP. Diamonds got to this point where the currency is just unbalanced and they're way too OP. And now it's like there's no point. Like basically, sorry for burping. Um, basically, diamonds are just a currency that are a lost cause at this moment. We don't really know what to do with them. We have this idea of converting them to super diamonds. So if you guys think that's a good idea, let me know. Um, but basically, we want to take our current diamonds, have this like pull thing that you have to get past at some point in the game where you have to like convert your diamonds to super diamonds. And then there's going to be a converter. And in that converter, you'll basically use all of your diamonds, but you'll convert them to super diamonds. And then it'll sort of balance out this currency where you can only get a max amount of super diamonds. So it'll kind of be like pet sim where the currency is capped. I don't really know what we'll do, but maybe we could use that for that. So if you guys think that's a good idea, let me know. Um, pretty sure we used all of these, I think. Did we use this golden Russo? I don't know if we did, but we got a lot of different Russo pets. I think we used these as some Robux ones. Here's the first ever Bobux pets. Some of these pets I really wanted to reuse, like these, for example. Um, YZ did an amazing job on these. These pets came out so well. I, I, I think... The way that they're modeled, like the, the style is so cool. They look like a mobile game. Like they look they look like next level, but the problem is there's so many like verts or tries or whatever. If you know anything about like modeling and stuff, the way they were modeled, it's just not optimized for like performance. So we can't really put too many of them in the game, unfortunately, but they do look really, really good. I'd, I'd love to have like a golden version of this guy. Um, definitely want to have these remade as a better optimized version. Cause like, they're honestly so sick. Like, I, I love the way those are modeled. That fossil dominus right here looks sick. Um, but yeah, this is basically just our entire assets place of all the pets that we used. I don't think there's any secret pets that I didn't ever show you guys that we haven't used. I think it's just all pets that we actually used. Here's the Russo boss, as you guys can see, you know, kind of weird, but you know, he looks pretty fancy. Not weird, okay? He looks amazing. He's got the mad scientist glasses. If you didn't know, this is the glasses from the mad scientist pet. And then, um, He's got like a particle thing that, that is from those pets as well on his hands. And then he has like part of one of the pet on his arm. Pretty creative, honestly. Oh, there's the mad scientist pet, yeah. <laughs> so yeah, see those glasses? Right on there. Looks really funny. Um, Anything else? I don't think there's any other secret pets. Here is some future pets. As you guys might've seen already, I don't know why they're imported twice, but 
we got these Among Us pets coming soon. Now, I kind of already leaked these, but yeah, these are going to be coming. This is the egg, the Among Us egg. It looks so cool. Little Among Us body is an egg. And then all these Among Us pets, they look so good in quality, but like, look at this one. That one is sick, bro. It's got that like death effect on. Actually looks crazy. But yeah, these are the imposter pets. I tried to have all of them have like a different little, um, a different little, what's it called? Like accessory. So that it really feels like the imposter among us characters. And I think the modeler did a really good job on those. But yeah, those are, those are going to be coming pretty soon. And also, if you guys have seen this portal, remember this portal pet that I, uh, we had as a free pet? Well, we actually have a giant version right here. You might be wondering, why do we have a giant version? Well, I just thought this was modeled so well that I want it to be something in the game. I don't know what, but I just want it. I want it to like mean something. I want it to like be a portal somewhere for something. I don't know what, I don't know why, but this is just why we have a portal that's giant here. And this is our entire assets place. So there's no other assets other than this area. As you guys can see over here, these are all of the islands we had made. So like these are all the islands that a Zillow modeled. They were just kind of like reskins. So like each time it was like the same island, just different colors and themes. And they looked really good, but like it started to get boring after having them, you know, just reskinned the entire time. So that's why I had a new island uh, style model. So if you haven't played Space Island, go play that. Obviously I just uploaded a main channel video on it and the updates out, but yeah. This is the Space Island island without the lighting. So if you guys have seen it in game, it looks entirely different. This is what it looks like without the lighting effect. So like, it looks crazy without the lighting effect. It doesn't even look dark or anything. In the, in the, actual, in the actual game, it's like purple and dark and neon. So it's crazy what lighting modifiers can actually do. But yeah, this is what it looks like behind the scenes, not actually in game. Got this little pet pod sign. I think we moved it in the main version, but um, yeah, that's what we got for our assets place in, in Tapping Gods. Now I wanna show you guys, I'm not gonna do like a full video. I'm just gonna show you for maybe a few minutes, Anime Battle Tycoon. I'm gonna make a full on main channel video very, very soon, um, teasing and sneak peeking this game again, but let me just hop in Anime Battle Tycoon and see what's going on right now, because there's been a few changes. Also, look at this secret right here. Many people will not notice this, but on the egg of the space egg, there's a use star code Russo uh, message on the actual chair arm. Like there's also one on the earth. It's pretty obvious. That one's bigger. But the fact that there's one on here, like nobody will see that. That is actually such a cool little feature right there. I love that. So it's on the egg that you can barely look at. I don't think anybody will see that. And this egg is actually really cool. It's literally a spaceship, but an egg. Look at that. That actually looks so cool. All right, let's go ahead and hop in Anime Battle Tycoon and see if anything's changed there. Make sure, I'll leave a link in the description. Make sure you go to this game, favorite it, follow it, all that stuff, because it's going to be coming out pretty soon. And I really, really, really want to see it do well. All these anime games are coming out doing really well. And I know this game has potential. The way it's being made, the, the scripting, the animations, all of it is like really premium. So I, I really think it has a chance to be big. And if you guys want to be a part of it early, Make sure you follow and all that stuff. Um, a lot of the things are not final. Like, for example, the sounds obviously aren't final. Um, the character names, we're going to be changing those. But yeah, this is what happens when you load in. I loaded in as Luffy. Luffy? I, I, I'm such an idiot. Oh, people are going to hate on me. I think it's Luffy, right? I literally don't know anything about One Piece, but I'm pretty sure his name is Luffy. But it seems like Luffy. I'm an idiot. Everyone's going to hate me, but I'm sorry. I don't know. Okay. I'm making an anime game and I don't know. Um, basically I'm working with a lot of developers to make like as many games as possible. I want to make a lot of Roblox games. I want to be a part of the creative process when it comes to developing. I don't really know anything, so I can't really do much as far as developing. All I can do is give my insight on what I think might work, what I think might be a good idea. So I'm just being honest with you guys. That's what I'm doing for these games. Like for example, in Tapping Gods, I'm doing a little bit more than, for example, like this game. Like with this game, I'm basically, I came up with the idea to do it based on my other, look at all these, dude. Um, I came up with the idea to do this game based on my previous Anime Tycoon game. And I just thought making that game, making Anime Tycoon, but better was such a good idea because Anime Tycoon had a lot of potential. It did really well, but it just, 
it, it didn't it, it never like surpassed what i thought it could be like it, it never got to the point where i thought like wow this is this is how good the game can be the game could have always been better and this is basically the game but way better look at this this build of these tycoons like this is actually so cool so each character has their own unique tycoon as you guys have seen luffy did not have one the last time i made a sneak peek video so this is me uh basically showing off his tycoon now and he's also got combat i don't think i showed you that look at this ready oh, look look at the gatling ready like what that looks so sick there's battle axe bro bazooka like these powers are like next level especially compared to anime tycoon but like even competing with these other anime games it looks amazing but yeah here's luffy's and again if i'm saying his name wrong literally everyone's gonna hate on me but i don't care it's just what i'm saying okay deal with it um i just realized we need to make a better way to go downstairs from here how do you go down oh yeah there's stairs gotta go down the stairs gotta go down here and let's exit by putting the arches down i think we finished it but yeah there it is look at his place wow i haven't seen his tycoon finish that looks amazing so that's his tycoon finish but look at all of this we got statues for where the characters are gonna be i think we got even more design in the map now the map looks way different than i showed uh previously it's got a lot of different like textures and uh look at these trees they look phenomenal but look, it's got crazy stuff. Look, we have this middle, like, teleport area. Just so cool. We got this right here. I don't even know what this is going to be, but it's something. I literally don't even know about a lot of this stuff. I don't know what this is going to be, but it's something. We got a freaking weapon shop right here. Look at this weapon shop. And I'm going to show more in my next sneak peek video on my main, ch main channel. But I just wanted to show you guys some secrets uh, in my games today. Um, we got portal right here. We got the menu, different things that you can click on. And a lot of this UI doesn't work yet, so I don't really want to click on it, but I don't think the X works yet. Yeah, it doesn't. Well, now I'm stuck. But anyways, I just want to show you guys some secrets and hopefully this excites you for the future of my games. And if there's ever anything else you want to see, like exclusive behind the scenes stuff, let me know. Um, cause this is my second channel where I just post random stuff like that. So hopefully you guys enjoyed. My throat is still kind of bothering me. So sorry if I was kind of weird, but thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. Go watch my main channel video. Go play Tapping Gods update and favorite and follow anime battle tycoon. This game is going to be sick. It's going to take Roblox by storm. I love you all. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye.